ladies, good morning and happy Sunday. I wanted to talk to you a little bit about what is mind, body, and soul investment. You see it all the time. I add it at the end of a lot of my posts, but what does it mean? Well, here's a concrete example. It's Sunday morning and I just finished my morning workout. Now, before that, I did a, a little bit of personal development. So this is the mind aspect of the mind, body, and soul. You're constantly reading, constantly stretching your thoughts, your mind. If you, if you want to increase your confidence, if you want to increase your, um, your courage, if you want to really start releasing those negative messages that you speak to yourself in your mind, then here's what I recommend personal development. Currently, I am reading a book titled The Have It All Woman. Now, it is written by a huge mentor of mine. Her name is Susan Sly. And so here's my Kindle and The Have It All Woman. It talks about health. It talks about investment of the mind, body, and soul. And it is totally in line with everything that I believe in. I totally recommend it. For a lot of us, it's like it's hard to be still and it's hard to sit down and read a book. But here's what I recommend you have a timer on your phone. Start with a five minute commitment. That is it, a five minute commitment to read some type of personal development book. Set your timer and start reading. As soon as the timer start, goes off, you, you stop and that's it. And so here's the thing, sometimes we just like we do with fitness, just like we do with, um, I, I don't know, any kind of positive change that we're doing, we dive all in and we do two hours at the gym or we do a two hour workout or we read an entire book and <laughs> the, the, it, it's awesome, right? Because we're excited, you're motivated. But here's the thing, consistency is key. So create the habits that you're able to stick to right? Um, I know personally, I can't stick to reading um, 45 minutes every day in one sitting. And so I asked myself, well, what is something doable for me? For me, 25 minutes a day is very doable and I am able to stay consistent with it. Um, otherwise, I, I, I would tell myself, oh, I don't have 45 minutes today, so I'm just not going to do it. Set Start creating habits one step at a time. Before you know it, one positive habit builds on another. I started off with five minutes of reading every day. I'm at 25 minutes now and I found that golden number. Ladies, there is the mind aspect of the mind, body, and soul. Choose a book, choose a reading, choose an audio that is going to stretch your thoughts, that's going to feed positive messages to your mind to combat those negative ones. Have a great Sunday. Remember, self-investment is the best form of investment. Mind, body, and soul. See you later.